In today's video, we are going to use an inline spark plug tester to verify that we have a spark at a particular spark plug in, the, in an engine. Useful little tool. Uh, I got this in Canada 2023 at Princess Auto for I think it was like 10 or 12 dollars. The reason that I'm making a video on the spark plug tester is because my van has been running extremely rough. I put my code reader on it because the check engine light came on. I'll put a link down below to using this code reader. And it came up with a P301 code. And that is a cylinder one misfire. If you can see this in the book here, the Haynes manual, hopefully you can get one of these. I'm sure you can Google it and find out. It says cylinder one misfire detected. And over in this section of the book, it shows me that on this vehicle, which I have a 2007 Ford Freestar, cylinder one, here's the front of the engine, cylinder one is up here. But we're going to sh use this on a, no, a cylinder that is not throwing an error code just to show you how to use it. We are going to remove the spark plug wire off of cylinder number six. So I've already loosened this off, but if you're kind of tight, move them back and forth like that first, and then pull it out. Then we take the spark plug tester, and we put this end over the spark plug, like so. Push it in there till you kind of feel it pop in. And then, We'll take our spark plug wire. Oops, I'm going to move my camera here. And you put this, the boot, over that end of the tester. The metal probe is on here good and secure, but I don't like the way this is popping onto the spark plug down there. It's not, it's too uh, loose. Here's an old spark plug when I remove them. So what I'm gonna do, is tighten that up a little bit there so more than that maybe we want a little better a little snugger of oops that ain't snug <laughs> okay now i'll go the other way and open it up but you see what i'm getting at you want that to take a good bite on the spark plug so there that'll open it back up now, we'll put that in place. Now that I crimped that with our pliers, yeah, that feels better. That's more snug. I'm going to throw that boot down a bit. And we'll try that. I think you can see there, that's what you should see with a properly firing To show you something if you're troubleshooting something like this i took the van for a test drive with the spark plug tester still on then i reset the engine codes before i took it for a drive and came back and read the codes i have i have the tester set up here and we can see that we have four codes the 301 113 102 and 113 again just what i want to illustrate to you is we note we have a couple of mass airflow uh, indications which is probably due to the fact that we have a cylinder that is not firing and the 301 cylinder one misfire we saw that that code is still on there but we do not have a code for the cylinder that we had a spark plug tester on because even with the tester on, that cylinder is firing correctly. Uh, anyway, I hope uh, this was helpful. Thanks for watching.